basically I'm a hypnotist. So what I do is I help people, people ask me all the time, do you help people with smoking? And I say, yeah, I do help people, I help them quit smoking. They, they want to know, how do you do it? How do you make people stop smoking? Well, first of all, my fee is somewhere around six or seven cartons of cigarettes every time you come to see me, that's twice a week. But for now, I don't do funny stuff, I don't make rabbits pop out of hats and things like that. Right now, I'm going to ask to keep your attention on me. Focus on me, everyone, focus on me. You can try this in the audience. I want everybody to watch me. I'm going to ask you to put your hands together, like such. All right, good. That was a splattering. I want to hear a clap, <laughs> a nice loud clap. OK? Ready, on three. One, two. Are you watching me? <laughs> good, good, good. I see people here that can help me tonight. Ready, this is for all the marbles, all the marbles. Ready, one, two, three. Hands closed together, fingers interlocked together. Everybody can see that? Okay, you got that. Now I want you to hold that. Get ready for part two. Part two is this. Part two, I'm going to extend, wait, watch me. You're going to extend your index fingers out like such. And you're going to stare at them just like this. You can see me, you can see me staring at my fingers, right? And what I want you to do is I want you to imagine that there are powerful magnets on each of your fingers. Does everybody understand me? Nod your head if you understand. Good, good. I want you to imagine that you have powerful finger, powerful magnets on each of your fingers and they have such a powerful attraction that you can't keep them apart. Does everybody understand? Okay, ready. Ready for part two, ready. One, two, three, get those fingers out, get those fingers out about one inch apart, stare at them, watch them, closing. Look at you, closing, 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 close. Good, relax everybody, give yourself a round of applause. That is uh, an example of suggestibility, okay? And if you weren't suggestible, you couldn't learn. Now see, I looked around the crowd and I monitored some of the results. Some of you people, you were there, almost there. I saw your fingers come together, and that's people of mild intelligence. You know, even mild intelligence should get some kind of response. People of medium intelligence, more medium intelligence, their fingers came to go together very quickly. And then you are people who I consider intellectuals, very smart people. Their fingers came together and they're still stuck right now. And I had to tell them, release their fingers. And of course, there are some of you out there that can't bring nothing together. <laughs> I'm referring to some of the ladies here. I wasn't really, not really supposed to be watching, but you couldn't keep your legs together. I mean, it was like a, <laughs> I'm sorry. It was like a common cold in a nursery school that was spread everywhere. But listen, now I need volunteers. There's no children in the audience tonight, so I can get a little racy. Everybody here is over 18, is that correct? Is that correct? Good. Okay. If you want to volunteer, wait a second. If you want to volunteer right now, put your hands up real high. If you think that you'd be a good candidate to volunteer, put your hands up. Put your hands up. I can't do this show without you. I am not the star of the show. You are the star of the show. Ken, are you feeling this? Yeah. Come on up here. All right. All right. Good to see you. Good round of applause for our. Play an instrument that you don't see too often. The accordion. I have one. Do you? No, I don't. Have one. <laughs> <laughs> I, I play a little piano, not much. See the that kind of stuff. But you sound good here tonight. Listen, I'm going to ask you to uh, follow my instructions. Okay. Okay. And for this this purpose tonight, I want you to use your imagination, use your creativity, dig deep into your mind. Good. I saw that. I felt it. Now I'm going to show you. Things. And as long as you can picture these things in your mind, you will think that everything I'm telling you is the truth. You have to believe that. And you can do this. Anybody can do this. You can take a picture, an image, a thought, anything. You can put it in your mind and if you picture it very, very vividly, you can get yourself to believe that that picture, that image, that thought is reality. You are in the driver's seat. Does everybody understand? Not your head. Thank you. Okay, and we're going to try to be suggestive. Suggestive. Okay, I'm going to just stand here. Thanks, me. Put your feet together. Good. Thanks. Thanks. I'm going to sway you off balance. Don't move your feet. Don't move your feet. 
I've got you. I'm going to swing your back. You understand? Good. Good. Let's resist this. Let's do this. Do this. Good. 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 Don't get your eyes closed down. That's good. Relax. Relax. Okay? One, two. <laughs> I'm about to slam you. Ken does Kung Fu. Ken does Kung Fu. You do Kung 
Kung Fu. Why don't you show the people some of your Kung Fu moves tonight? Stay on the stage. Just a few Kung Fu moves. They're going to call it too. I've seen you do it. Great. Start your Kung Fu. Yeah. Just start your Kung Fu. He said, what's Kung Fu? Good. Excellent. Thank you. Outstanding. Look at this. Oh, my God. Good. Good. Keep it sweet. Good. All right, everybody. Give it up for Ken. Parties and corporate events. I'm a catalyst for fame. Use it. 